work hard, got to snack hard too. Got to save them turkey men. Morning, folks. Beautiful morning this morning. Old Grimes getting the Polaris unloaded. We are out here today. We're going to do some pre-turkey season chores. Got a couple food plots that never got planted past deer season. So uh, we're going to go spray them. Hopefully try to get some clover in the ground here in a couple weeks. In the midst of all this, we're going to put out a couple coon traps. See if we can take care of couple of these nest predators. Y'all stick with us, see what we got going on today. You gotta say to the folks, Grimes. A little chilly this morning, we gotta get a little work done. That's right. For old turkey birds. We gonna get after it. Just regular old glyphosate. Not a whole lot going on here. Good fit. Call a redneck boom sprayer right there. They grow up as you can tell. When you work hard, got to snack hard too. Mmm. Good, good cookie. Old gas station cookie coming in clutch. Mm hmm. I'll give it a uh, 6.9. Now we're on to the trapping segment of the show. Two types of traps we like to use. We use a cage trap, pretty standard. Catches uh, stray cats and your raccoons and possums. To get it set up right here, we also use coon cuff traps. Coon cuff, dog proofs, whatever you want to call them. So we're gonna get these plugged in and I'll show you what we do. Usually if you got these deer feeders, you can get these coons to like come in here pretty habitually. So I like to just set them up around those mostly. Regular fang style ground anchor. Wrong. Just get that set. Pull up on this, make sure it sets in the ground. Oh yeah. It's nice and set, that's not going anywhere. Now we get our bait. Some people like to use dog food. Some people like to use marshmallows. We like to use our secret ingredient, and that is Twizzlers. Get them every want, time. You want to wear out a coon and good snack too. Leave them a couple of them outside for it. Get them a little corn around here too. Get them all excited. So, this is the other type of trap we use this is a cage trap. Basically, it's a little simpler. You just got a uh, trap door. Comes up, a little shelf. I like to stick it up in something so that they want to come straight in the door. They don't go around it, they don't fish around it or anything. And I basically just put them a trail of breadcrumbs going in there. And inside is their main prize. Basically, we're just trying to get these nest predators going out of here. Best time to do it right before turkey season gets here. Gives us something to do in the uh, off season. On to the next spot. Right, a couple more traps out. Another thing we find is these coons, they'll walk the edge of this water. If you got water, that's a good place to start if you don't know where the coons are. Go along your creek banks and your edges of your ponds and all that. You can usually find some there. Well, that's pretty much it for the day. Got some coon traps put out, food pot sprayed. Be back next weekend to do some mowing. After that, we'll be planting and burning. So plenty to do before turkey season gets here. Just trying to make the habitat as good as we can for these birds. So appreciate y'all watching. Hang with us. Yeah, yeah. PK, you ready? As you can see, this is not our typical trapping attire. Just got done playing a little golf with the boys. Down to the big stick. Now we're here to check the trap line and uh, old Jordan and PK decided to come along with us today. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna move a couple traps around and uh, see what we got. Let's go. 
You ready? You ready? Look at that. It's, it, you gotta really hold it. We putting yeah, them traps out, the Pecan? can't hold it. Mm. <laughs> we on the way to go check some traps. Uh, cell cam went off. Got a coon in the trap. We're gonna go get him. Got one caught. I'm gonna need y'all to do this. I'm gonna need y'all to hit that like button for them Twizzlers. Try it out on your next trapping excursion and smash that subscribe button for the giveaway. Clint couldn't be with us tonight. He is uh, hopefully not having a baby yet. It's still a few weeks, but he's with his wife at the hospital. Brought my hunting partner and fiance. In case you didn't know about raccoons, fun fact, okay? Well, not so fun fact. Um, for turkey season, not a good idea because they eat eggs. Turkey eggs, not a good idea. No bueno, so they gotta go. Crap, we gotta get Twizzlers at the gas station. So, just gonna have to improvise a little. Back out here today, on the trap line, got a couple coons caught. We about to get in here and dispatch them. Let's go. Let's go. Got another couple caught. This was a wet one. All right, that's number six and seven. Put a pretty good hurting on them. We're about to uh, pull all these traps and get out of here. So that's it for this episode. Got a child that'll be coming here soon and I ain't gonna be able to come to these, check these traps. Ain't that right, Bricky? Uh, appreciate y'all watching. We're gonna get these traps and coons loaded up. Get out there, and try out some trapping and uh, see can you save a few nests. Appreciate y'all. Got them loaded up, got out of there. That's another thing about trapping. I mean, just in this video alone, there's six different people. So that's what it's all about. Just getting everybody and enjoying the outdoors and spending time together. So get out there, do a little trapping and uh, save them turkey nest. Forget, forget, smile. <laughs> action. Big action. <laughs> Make sure you like, and comment, giving away fall line merch every week. Appreciate y'all. Why wow, so close? Back it up, Terry. Dude, look at your nose. Gotta save them turkey nests.